Hi, my name is Dustin Hedger. I've been playing tennis for 25 years now and coaching for 17 years. I'd like to teach you the three most fundamental strokes in the game of tennis today. The first shot I'd like to teach you today is the volley. The volley is a shot that you hit in tennis when you are close to the net, inside the service court area. You're either hitting the ball in the air or after the bounce, and the three most important parts of the volley are one, the stance, two, the proper grip, and three, the proper contact point. The stance for the volley is referred to as the athletic position. Feet shoulder width apart, knees slightly bent, heels off the ground, weight forward, rack it out in front of your body, tilt it upward. When hitting the volley, it's critical that you use the proper grip. The proper grip for the volley is referred to as the continental grip or the hammer grip. To get the hammer grip or continental grip, simply slide your hand down the side of the racket as if you're holding a hammer. The last step of the volley is making contact. From the athletic position, when the ball comes to one side, simply turn your body to that side, step, and block the ball back in play. Notice that when you make contact with the volley, the racket head is going to freeze. You don't want a big swing and a follow through. The backhand side, same principle applies. When the ball comes to your backhand side, turn, step, and block the ball out in front of your body. When you're hitting a shot from behind the baseline from the back court of a tennis court, you're hitting what's called a ground stroke. And when you're hitting a ground stroke, it's important to be able to impart topspin on the ball. This enables you to hit the ball hard without hitting the ball long. In order to hit topspin, you must create a path of the racket, whereas the racket starts at a level below the ball and finishes at a level up above. This creates a rainbow effect on the ball, such that you can hit the ball hard, but the ball still will go in play. When hitting a forehand topspin ground stroke, there are three things to keep in mind. One, the proper grip. Two, the proper beginning. And three, the proper finish to the stroke. The grip that you want for a forehand topspin ground stroke is the same grip that you use to pick up a pan from the ground. When the ball comes to you from ready position, if you're behind the baseline, simply take the racket back, and when the ball comes, step, swing from low to high, brushing up the back of the ball, following through the opposite shoulder. When hitting a backhand topspin ground stroke, there are also three things to keep in mind. The grip, the beginning, and the finish of the shot. First, the proper grip. Your right hand is gonna slide right down the side of the racket. Your non-dominant hand will slide down the racket and rest gently on top of the dominant hand. When the ball comes, we're gonna turn our body, step, swing from low to high, brush up the back of the ball, follow through over the opposite shoulder. The last shot I'd like to teach you today is the shot that many consider to be the most important shot in tennis, the serve. When tossing the ball, you put the ball in the throat of the racket or on the strings, and your hands can go down together, up together on the windup. You're gonna release the ball with your left hand or non-dominant hand, such that the ball is going to be at least six inches above how high you can reach with your racket. Maybe higher, but never any lower. I want you to think of a motion that's probably very familiar to you, that of throwing a baseball. Because in fact, the baseball throwing motion is the same motion we want to use when serving a tennis ball. The racket's going to come back behind her head, reach upward with the ball, coming over the upper right hand corner of the ball, and following through on the left side of our body. All together, it will look like this. Down together, up together, hooray, and throw the racket at the tennis ball. And there you have it. If you follow my concise tips on how to volley, hit a ground stroke, and hit a serve, you'll have conquered the primary skills that you need to play the game of tennis. Happy hitting. Hope to see you on the courts.